हॅलो एव्हरी वन माय सेल्फ मिसेस प्रतिज्ञा पाटील असिस्टंट प्रोफेसर फ्रॉम फिजिकल एज्युकेशन डिपार्टमेंट सांगुकाना ठाकूर आर्ट्स कॉमर्स अँड सायन्स कॉलेज ऑटोनॉमस अवर सब्जेक्ट इज फाउंडेशन कोर्स इन फिजिकल एज्युकेशन टुडे वी आर गोईंग टू स्पीक अबाउट अष्टांग योग इन संस्कृत अष्ट मीन्स एट लिम्ड अष्ट मीन्स एट अंग मीन्स लिम्ड अष्टांग योग इज अ एट लिम्प पाथ टुवर्स्ट अचिविंग द स्टेट ऑफ योगा असो नोन ॲज समाधी योगा इज अ सेन्सेशन ऑफ फ्लक्च्युएशन्स ऑफ द माइंड वेन द माइंड इज स्टील अँड द स्टेट ऑफ योग इज रीच द इंडिव्हिज्युअल माइंड इज ॲट वन विथ द युनिव्हर्सल माइंड अँड इंडिव्हिज्युअल कॉन्शियसनेस विथ द डिवाईन कॉन्शियसनेस अँड वी एक्सपिरियन्स अवर डिवायनिटी थ्रू द युनिटी द फर्स्ट स्टेप ऑफ अष्टांग योग इज यम restraint or observance regarding how the aspiring yogi should relate to his or her community the first yam is ahimsa means non violence the second yam is satya means truthfulness you have to speak truth every time third step of third yam is asteya means non stealing you cannot steal any material thing or any ideas from anyone fourth yam is brahmacharya means conservation of vital energy and fifth yam is aparigraha means non holdings the second step of ashtang yoga is niyam there are also five yam niyams intense observances that the aspiring yogi should carry out in his or her daily life in order to have body and mind suited for yoga the first niyam is sauch means cleanliness of body as well as mind second niyam is santosh means contentment third step is discipline tapas means discipline and fourth niyam is swadhyay means self study and fifth niyam is ishvara pranidhana means surrender to the divine third step of ashtang yoga is asan the word literally translated to seat these are meditative postures that promote stillness of mind and physical postures that facilitate sitting on the from long period of mind in those meditative postures the fourth step of ashtang yoga is pranayam pran is a life force means breathe means vital energy and the yam is restraint the pranayam translated to extension of the life force pranayam are breathing practices that involves retention of breath the fifth step of ashtang yoga is pratyahara withdrawal of the senses from things that are not conductive of to the practice of yoga a moving from external to internal world when the five senses are quelled and the mind can then become still the fifth step of ashtang yoga is dharana concentration on a single thing ideally something spiritual in nature means dharana the seventh step of ashtang yoga is dhyan dhyan means meditation uninterrupted for flowing concentration in which the meditator begin begins to merge with the object of meditation and la- eighth step of ashtang yoga is samadhi a super conscious trance in which the mind merge fully with the and become one with the object of meditation in the highest state of samadhi there is no longer any object of meditation these are the eight limbs of ashtanga yoga which learn today thank you very much